Hello, this is Ryan, the product specialist with Lighting Supply Company, and today we will be talking about HID ballast. The three main types of metal halide ballast are going to be your core and coil, your F-can, and then your electronic. Core and coil ballasts are probably the most popular HID, and for this instance, metal halide ballasts out there. They're typically seen in parking lot lighting and street lighting. The pros and cons of core and coil ballasts, um, we'll start with the pro. They last forever. There's a few moving parts that are relatively inexpensive to replace, and the main thing, especially for northern regions, are they work extremely well in the cold since there's no electronic function to them. The cons with these type of ballasts are they do generate a lot of noise, so for indoor applications they're not always the best, and they are the least efficient out of the three. An F-can ballast by its name is made to mimic a fluorescent electronic or magnetic ballast. It is called a potted ballast because it does have the same components as the core and coil that are encased in this nice can. Some of the applications would be for a lot of indoor use in, in vestibules for recessed cans. Some of the pros for using this since it's designed for indoor, it has a much lower noise and frequency distribution than its core and coil counterpart. And it also fits in more fixtures than this ballast would. And cons with this style ballast, it is not generated very well for outdoor use. So you have to be careful where you're gonna use this. In a soffit, I would say yes. In outdoor fixtures, I would not use this specific ballast. The newest HID ballast on the scene, just like with all technology, is going electronic. So we have an electronic HID, and again in this instance, metal halide ballast. The component, pretty simple. It's just this one casing with, instead of a core and coil or a magnetic function, it's electronically controlled. These are very popular in retail. If you're in a retail store, you'll see light bulbs shining on clothes, things at the mall. These fit really nicely in smaller fixtures. The pros of the electronic ballast, again, efficiency. Since it is electronically controlled, rather than its counterparts, which were electromagnetically controlled, that magnetic portion really made it inefficient. By being fully electronic, you're using less wattage, and again, it's even quieter in operation than these two are. The cons for electronic HID, and specifically metal halide ballast, are that just like its F-CAM counterpart, it does not do well in the cold. Especially in northern climates, you have to be very careful by looking at the manufacturer's spec sheet to see minimum starting temps. If those temperatures drop below that minimum starting temp, you will have plenty of problems trying to get your lamps to operate normally. And with any more questions regarding these type of products, please give one of our experts at Lighting Supply a call.